Hi, welcome. Grandma Honey here and I have another story for you. This one's called Peter the Cruise Ship. It's written by Captain Hans Mitbauer and it's illustrated by Thompson Digital. All right, let's get started. Peter the cruise ship travels all over the world and has many adventures on the oceans. Most ships are Peter's friends. He meets many of them whenever he's out to sea. Today, new passengers are coming on board. They arrive by plane, car, or bus, and they bring lots of luggage and are very excited about cruising with Peter. Peter is really happy to see them and welcomes them with a blast of his horn. Beep, beep, bonk. The captain steers the ship from the bridge. He tells the sailors to be very careful. Peter is glad to have a good captain. See the sailors, they're saying, aye, aye, sir. And deep down below in the engine room, the engineer starts Peter's motors. The propellers start to turn. Chugga, 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 chugga. Peter blows his whistle at the other ships. Toot, toot. And they watch as Peter sails from the harbor. The passengers wave goodbye to their friends ashore. Some of them are saying, clang, clang. Other ships are going, beep, beep. One says, auga, auga. And ring-a-ling-a-ling, ring-a-ling-a-ling. -a -ling. But Peter carefully steers towards the ocean and the red and green buoys warn him of shallow water. There they are. On the ocean, Peter meets his friends. Slick is a container ship. He goes putter, 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 putter. Rusty's an old cargo ship. He goes huff and puff and huff and puff. And Gulp is an oil tanker. He goes chug-a-lug-a, chug -a -lug -a. But Peter and the other ships stay away from Push the tugboat. Push always bumps into the other ships and is grumpy all the time. He says harumph. Peter and his friends travel all over the world. They visit Europe, Japan, China, India, Africa, Australia, and South America. They sail the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, and the Indian Ocean. They love seeing all these different places. At night, Peter is guided by the stars. They go twinkle, twinkle. And he knows the other ships by their red, white, and green lights. But at dawn, the weather starts to change. And the wind is going. <sighs> the sea is wild. The waves are high and rough. The wind howls. Whoosh, crackle, boom. There's thunder and lightning, and all the ships are tossed around. Peter knows he has to stay away from the rocks. Suddenly, Peter hears a cry for help in the distance. Help! Help! Yeah. Uh-oh. It's rusty. He can't handle the big waves any longer. Rusty shouts. He's very afraid. Peter sails as fast as he can to rescue Rusty, and so does push the tugboat. Crash, whoosh, bang. Sometimes the waves in the sea foam cover Peter completely, but he keeps going. Peter reaches Rusty first. Push arrives too. We'll save you, Peter shouts. Hold on, says Push, and he throws a rope and bumps into Rusty. Oh, sorry, says Push. 
But Rusty doesn't mind the bump. He knows Push is doing his job. Thank you, Rusty says, while Push steadies him and pulls him to safety. Peter is glad that they are now all friends. Push too. He says, phew. Push goes thump. Push tows Rusty to a harbor where they are greeted by Tim, the old tugboat, and his little son, Teddy. They will tow Rusty to the shipyard for repairs. Chug-a-chug, sputter-sputter. That's what he says. And finally, Peter arrives at his first port. It's a beautiful tropical island. He's in such a hurry, though, he lets down his anchor and it drops on Fluke the whale. Thump. Fluke is having breakfast with his family. Ow, she cries. What hit me? Uh-oh. At the end of the day, it's time for Peter to leave. Fluke is still angry. His head is very sore. Peter feels bad, and he wants to make up for, with Fluke. Peter knows he has to apologize. I'm sorry, Fluke. I was in a hurry because I was late after helping Rusty, he explains. That's okay, says Fluke. We all make mistakes. Finally, Peter arrives back at his home port. Grumble, the bridge complains. You're too tall, you'll hit me. So Peter sails very carefully under Grumble. All of Peter's friends are there, including Push, to tell the stories of their adventures at sea. Slick goes, clang, clang. Gulp goes, beep, beep. Rusty, honk. The next day, Peter leaves the harbor again. He's ready for new adventures. Goodbye, he shouts as he sets sail. The end. And that's our story for today. Peter the cruise ship. Bye-bye for now. Be blessed. <laughs>